right, my minions. So I've got another product review for you today for Fun Fridays. So I was having lighting issues. <clears throat> Forgive me, I got cooties. <laughs> so having lighting issues. <clears throat> so I decided, you know what? I need to get some lights. A multi-purpose kind of area light. They can act as floodlights. They can act as basically whatever you need, especially for recording purposes. But hey, you might have some nighttime searches you need to do. I mean, personnel searches. You know, make sure nobody's going on in anything that's supposed to be. So, but anyway, <laughs> light. So I said, you know what? Time to just go get it. See what's out there. Walked into the Home Depot, and I kid you not, I walked in, and they were right there, right, right there on the left. A whole nice display of exactly what I was looking for. So Defiant has these lights. This is what they look like. Defiant. There's two of them. $27. Rounding up. And they are bright as hell. They've got this uh, varying changing handle. You can hold them, you can hang them up. You can angle them on the ground, they'll sit. They're also magnetic. So uh, you can stick them on cars, stick them on anything metal, hang them up, hang them low. They'll stick together because they're magnetic. So, bam. Three different, they have three different light, um, three different light settings, plus a strobe setting. You get the power button, and it's actually rechargeable via uh, USB. So, USB A and USB C, it seems. So, let's see, hopefully, I don't blind you. Let's power this up now. That's one setting. <laughs> Medium, low, strobe, and off. Easy peasy, just si easy, very simple. All you gotta do is hit the button. Now, even though this is kind of, this is a decently lit um, <clears throat> space, let's test this out here. So you can still see a big major difference in turning it on during the day. Yeah, I still get, get the area very well lit. Got a nice decent shadow going on behind me. I'll, I'll play around with the camera angles, but everything's lit up. It's not dark, it's not fuzzy, and again, I can adjust the settings as I need to. Let's put it down on the lowest setting. So even during the day, you need a little bit more light. These are perfect. You get $27. This is the box that it came in. I made sure that I could keep the box nice and nice and pristine. <laughs> so that I can show y'all. You can pause this if you want. And you can read. So, but again, it's two pack, 2000 lumens. So, very good. So, two type US, two type C USB <laughs> charging cable. And it comes with two charging cables that I have. But yes. That is a very good um, lighting system. And then I have also tested it out in the field at night, and which you will see right now. All right, my minions. So I'm out here field testing these lights. You see it's dark. It's about uh, 21, 23 right now. So it's definitely dark. We got some ambient lighting in the back or basically just night light. <laughs> Um, so from some of the street lights, but it is dark out here. And as you can see, as far as recording goes, or just visibility in general, it's a bit problematic. So I've actually got the lights at 
attached to the um, my vehicle right now. So, <clears throat> excuse me, I still got cooties. I've been relapsing. So, I'm gonna turn just one on and we're gonna check and see the difference. As you can see, make the major, major difference. This is just one. You see, I've got old, old painless on, on, on me. And I, <laughs> I'm, out, I'm, out, I'm out in the field working. But it makes a big difference as far as recording, area lights, security lighting. You know, if you're, um, I've done some fugitive recovery and some investigations where I needed some night lighting. And especially fugitive recovery when I need to pull off, you know, capture fugitive but you're not going to do a deep search right there on a the spot you want to take that person somewhere else you want to get out of that area so take some more guard have hopefully have a pre-arranged plan that you could do a deep deep search of the fugitive but you may need, need proper light if you can't find an empty plaza empty park lot or a well-lit area then you're going to need proper lighting um, you're gonna need proper lighting to do your search. You do just basically just operate. So this is just one light right here. I'm gonna turn on the second light. And you can see it's so bright it almost drowns out like it's not like reflecting off of me. Like it's how bright these lights are. So then I'm gonna turn uh, I'm gonna turn the lights down. Cause it's got three settings. So let me turn these down. This is two lights at the lowest setting. And so now you can judge it. You can judge the different type of lighting that you need. I'm like blinded right now. I'm like, I don't even know if I'm staring into this camera correctly. <laughs> and of course you've got your strobe. I'm gonna turn this around so you can give you a view of how, if possible, so basically I've got the uh, lights mounted on the car because it's magnetic. And turning one off, and you can see how yeah, it sticks. And I'll get a daylight shot of it. But there you have it. So this it makes a makes a major major difference. That's just mounted on the car. Obviously, it's got the it's got the handles. You can sit on the ground. You can hang it or whatever you need to do. But um, that's twenty seven dollars I ever spent. <laughs> and there you have it. Defiant lights, very good. And again, I'm not being endorsed by Defiant, but if I see a product, if I come across a product that I find is good, I want to share with y'all. You know, especially in our set, in our in the environment that we operate in, you might have, you might need to set up some floodlights, you might need to do some nighttime activities, some nighttime exercise, nighttime running, you might need to conduct a nighttime uh, PT test. Or again, you won't have to do, which I've done, um, nighttime searches, or it's good for filming. When you need some decent lighting outside for filming, there's a couple of videos that I've done at night that I damn sure wish I had these. And now I do. So, we live, we learn, we grow. Is my mic still on? It's still on. <laughs> we had that haircut last time. So, thank you for being here. I greatly appreciate you being here. Please like, subscribe, like, subscribe, like, subscribe. Let me know what you think about um, the lights. Comment on this presentation. I will see y'all next time. Have a good one.